Hello, welcome to Tony Slimming Vlog, week 42. I did say I'm going to be coming to you this week with my weigh-in, with my motivation, with everything back on track. Didn't happen. Motivation is coming and going. Too easy at the moment. One minute I feel bang, I'm going to do it, the next minute I don't. And it's getting annoying. It really is because I know I can do this. But I have done a weigh-in. I put on four pounds, which you'll see on my Instagram. I did my little sticker with four pounds. Now I suppose that's four pounds in two weeks, so I could have, you know, could argue two pound a week. It could have been more, could have lost some with a little bit of exercise I've done. But it's still not good. You know, this is how we get back to square one. And it really is because <clears throat> you put all this effort in, all this hard work. And yes, in my case, my life change circumstances has really rocked the boat, changed the way I mentally think, and puts you in a daydream of days all the time. Until certain situations are changed, I can't honestly say when my motivation will be back 100%. I need it to be back now. I need to have my game back. I need to be the way I was six weeks ago, because if I carry on like this, I am soon gonna be doing a vlog back at 18, 19 stone plus, and that's not gonna happen. I don't want it to happen. So every day I say, in my head, I'm going to do my motivation. I'm going to do my insanity. I'm going to do my exercise. And the day just seems to pass my pass me by at the moment, which is getting, as I say, getting annoying. It's not fun. I just need to focus. I say I've got some new jeans that don't fit. I thought, oh, boom, you know, I'm focused on that. Yesterday when I weighed in. And it said I put on plus four. I was like, Christ, come on, Tony. You know, get back with this. Get back with the program. You can do it. Um, and that's that's where I am at the moment. You know, I'm just above 14 stone, which on the grand scheme, or the grand scale of things, I wanted to be 14 stone when I started. I am where I want to be. But I think because I went down to 13 and a half stone, I'm feeling a bit fatter. I'm feeling a bit bloated. And then that obviously comes into mind or, you know, comes into play in your head that, you know, you're on a, a downward spiral and, you know, what's going to catch you, what's going to stop you, if anything. Um, I suppose that's the point of my vlogs. It's the point to show, yeah, the Slimming World journey, but for people who have watched me from day one, and I thought, bloody hell, he's losing the weight quite easy, you know, he's doing amazing. It just shows you how someone with so much motivation, so much of a goal, so much determination to be skinny, to change my life, can have, you know, can change, you know. Not through choice, but through, through circumstances, you know. I never came on here on day one and said this is going to be an easy journey this is my wall i suppose you know people who do marathons go you know what you hit a wall this is my wall well massive wall it's more like the berlin wall and i've just got to get over it or smash through it you know it's it's easy actually to sit here or stand here or whatever i'm doing when i'm doing my vlogs to say I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. But hey, you know what, as soon as this camera goes off, as soon as I've uploaded to YouTube, there's another priority. Something else occurs, something else happens. And that's what I need to stop. I need to keep the motivation going. When I do my vlogs, when I get hyped up, when I think I'm going to do it and I can do it, I've then got to think about, you know what, follow it through. You've got people who watch you on YouTube who look at me for advice, inspiration, and in the moment, I feel like I'm just letting them all down. Um, yes, I suppose it's good to see true life, 
I don't really want to gloss over my vlogs and go, you know what, oh hey, everything's happy, everything's rosy, everything's amazing, when it's not. You know, when life's shit, I'd like to say life's shit. When life's amazing, I'd like to tell you that. But, you know, I will get there. These vlogs help. My accounts, Twitter, Instagram, they all help. My followers help me. And to a degree, my family, close family still help. Um, my friends definitely do, because they've seen my change. And I've got to look at it in a, my weight loss now in a completely different Perspection, sorry, spitting everywhere. Um, no, not perspective. I can't freaking say the word. I've got to look at things in a different perspective. There we go. Because before, when I was a big chunky monkey, which I was, I was married, family life, different goals, different aspirations different life to a degree now what I've got to think is yes I'm now single I have baggage I have children I have my life still I have obviously a wife until divorce happens you know but we're, we're separated we're still friends but I've got to look now as in am I attractive to other people Sounds stupid, but you know, that's the way I've got to look at it. I've got to get the body I wanted now, even more, because I'm not going to stay single forever. I know I'm not. In my head, I might want to, because <coughs> relationships are hardly work. But um, I just know that someone will come along one day, and if I let myself go, if I get back to the way I was, that someone is never going to come and never going to look. So, from a total vain point of view, which I'm not really, but I've got to be, I need to sort my collision course with fatness out and do it now. So, I hope you will all carry on watching me, all carry on following me, and... Just keep giving me your support, your motivation, and over the next few weeks, we will see a change, a change for the better, a big smiley face on my face, and um, I will get my mojo, my motivation, my weight loss, I will get everything I need back on track as soon as, but again, Thanks for watching my rambling vlogs about not my weight loss this week, but my weight gain. Still just over 14 stone, 14 stone, one pound, I think it is. So technically one pound off where I wanted to be, but I feel I need to give a big push. I feel I need to sort this out before it becomes catastrophic. I'll speak to you next week. See you later. Bye.